Hey, what's going on guys? This is JDM with uh, Southern Oregon Metalheads. Um, here to show you a quick little tutorial on how to make an egg cluster. As you can see, the uh, river's kind of blown out right now, so we've been just kind of hanging out and tying gear and playing with these heavy beats. So uh, let's go ahead and get this started real quick and we'll uh, knock this out for you. First off, you're going to need uh, three of these rubber bands and you're going to need about six beads. So what we'll do here is we'll go ahead and make a pink one for you. These pink translucent ones are really cool. What you're going to want to do first is you're going to want to take both these beads and thread them onto your uh, heavy tool. From there, you're going to take your heavy band and you're going to slide those beads directly onto that heavy band. So you'll have something like that. There'll be two of them. And from there, we're going to do two more of those. All right. So now that we've got all three of those made up, it should look something like this. What we're going to do is we're going to take those beads and stretch them out to where it gives you a little bit of an opening. Just like that. So go ahead and take one of those beads and put that in the opening. It should look something like that, like a cross. From that point, we're going to stretch these a little bit farther so that we can slide those top two beads in that hole. So it almost should look like that, like a little star. From there we're going to grab some white yarn and we are making an egg cluster so what this is going to represent is going to be the skein on the eggs. Go ahead and take that apart. slide that on one of the tops just like so I'm gonna flip that over and do exactly the same thing on that same on the other side so it looks something like that from there we're gonna take these beads and we're gonna start stretching these pulling these down on the rubber bands Make you pulling them really nice and tight and snug. So it's going to look something like just like that. From there, we're going to cut our tag ends of the heavy bands off. Make sure to pick up your bands from the river. You don't want to leave those laying all over the bank. And what you want to do there is take that white yarn and just kind of thread that and weave it in between all those little legs. Next step is pretty easy. We got a uh, one aught owner jig style tie hook. We're going to take that egg cluster and just thread it right through there. So it's something like that. And what you do from there is you just tie that right on to your uh, slip bobber. Right now we've got a regular bead on there, but we can go ahead and cut that off and I'll show you how we do it. Going to tie that directly on. Tim your tag end, tag end off. And you fish that right under your float. 
All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching, and uh, be sure to check out SouthernOregonMetalheads.com for uh, more tips and tricks. And if you're looking to purchase these uh, little beads, you're going to pick those up at uh, HeavyBeads.com. See you on the river. Mm -hmm.